Hey guys, in this video, I'm gonna teach you how to convert any Python file to an exe file in the easiest method. If you've never done it before, I will guide you step by step and details. Guys, please like this video and share with your friends, and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. So, without wasting time, let's get started. Well, if you never made an exe file from any kind of Python file, or you never converted a python file to an exe file or an executable file you might be thinking that this is very hard but in this video i'm gonna teach you how to convert any kind of python file to an exe file step by step and details and i'm gonna share a easy method with you so you can apply this method every time when you want to convert any kind of python file to an exe file or an executable file so to convert any kind of python file to an exe file we have to have the py installer module in our system so if you don't have the py installer in your system at first you have to install it so to install the py installer we can press window and r key and this little window will pop up and we can write cmd here or we can click the start menu and then we can search for cmd and the command prompt will appear we can also click here to install the py installer we have to type pip install py installer you have to type pip and install all the time when you want to install a module and after the pip and the install we have to type the name of the python module so you just need to press enter and it will search online and it will find the right module for you and as you can see that it's saying the requirement already satisfied because i already installed in your case it might take a minute to install the module you have to wait and after finishing that you can exit from the common prompt well if you want to look the documentation of pi installer you can go to this link and you will have the documentation and if you want you can go through it and you will find more options to apply but without wasting time i'm gonna show you how to do that easily as you can see that i have a python file and bunch of other files in a folder and and this is the python code i'm gonna convert it to an exe file but at first you have to remember that before converting any kind of python file to an exe file you have to remember that all the modules that you used in your python code those modules need to be installed in your system and then we need to open the command prompt or the powershell in the current folder where you have the python file so in this case we are going to use the windows powershell to open the powershell in the current folder you have to hold the shift in your keyboard and then click on the right button and then you can see that I have an option to open the PowerShell here. So just click on here and the PowerShell will open. And after opening the PowerShell, you have to type pi installer and then dash dash one dir. The meaning of one dir here is that all the file will be in the one directory. And then we need to type dash dash one file what does it mean that it's gonna make all the file into one file i mean our exe file and then you need to write dash dash name that means you can define the name of that exe file here you need to give a equal sign and then inside the inverted comma you need to type the name in this case this is a library management system so i'm gonna type lms and then to add an icon i need to type dash dash icon and then equal sign and then a inverted com and inside the inverted comma i need to type the name of the file but you should remember that you have to have the icon file in the current directory otherwise you have to give the full path of that file so we have the icon file in this folder as you can see that this is our icon we're just going to type the name of the icon icon.i co and then now we need to type the name of our python file so this is the name of our python file and then we're just going to press the enter and as you can see that it's started the process 
to make an exe file from our python file we just need to give some time it's gonna make the exe file from our python file and as you can see that building exe from exe-oo.talk completed successfully now the question is where you can find the exe file so you have to look for the exe file in the current folder you will have a folder called dist you have to go inside the folder and as you can see that we have a exe file in this folder and we successfully converted our python file to an exe file to give you the proof at first i'm gonna open this python file with the inbuilt ide and then i'm gonna run the python code from here just go to the run and then run module and as you can see that it's running from the source code and I just need to give the authentication after giving the username and password I'm just going to press on login and as you can see that the software is opened and now I'm going to exit from the software and now I'm gonna copy this exe file into this folder and, and now I'm gonna open the same program from this exe file I'm just going to open this file and after opening the file as you can see that I can run the same program from my exe file but we have a common prompt with the exe file so and now I'm gonna show you how you can get right up this window but this time we are going to make a batch file because to make an exe file from a python file you have to type same command again and again in the command prompt we are going to make a batch file and from the batch file we are going to run the command so to make a batch file just click the right button and then go to new and from the new click on the text document and then we are going to rename it script.bat and then just press enter after pressing enter you can see that the icon is different now and now we need to open the file with a text editor i'm just going to edit with the sublime text and after opening the file we are just going to type all the commands here now to get right of that command prompt we just need to type dash dash w i n d o e d windowed then we just need to give the name of our python file press ctrl s or just go to the file and click on save we can minimize the sublime text now we just need to run this file so to run this file I'm just going to click on right button and then just open and as you can see that it's going to do all the things by itself just taking some time wait for a while yeah beautiful and now it's done and now we can find the exe file in this folder and I'm gonna copy the same file again and deleting the old file and pasting here and running the new file again after running the new file as you can see that we no longer have the command prompt behind our exe file so to test that i'm just going to open this program just going to click on login and as you can see that we have the same software the same program everything is same nothing changed we just converted the python file to an exe file so that's all you need to do guys if you have any question please let me know in the comment below and like this video and share with your friends and subscribe to my channel right now if you haven't already and i will see you in the next video